I have a bunch of spaghetti in my hand. Has there been a time recently, or in your lifetime at all, that you've pulled the box out of the pantry by the wrong end, or maybe your kid's helping you and they grab the pasta box out of the pantry and then something like this happens, and then it flies everywhere and it makes a huge giant mess? Yeah, well that recently happened to me, <laughs> not just now. But let me explain more in a minute. So this happened to me a few weeks ago. My husband was on a business trip. He was gone for a week. I believe this was like the Thursday night or it's already been a long week and the kids are ready for bed and I'm ready for bed. And I think I was getting out this pasta, getting ready for the next day meal. And my daughter was in the kitchen with me. And anyway, the box ended up all over the floor and it was great. So it was a great mommy test to see, am I gonna freak out and yell and send everyone away and have a giant make a bigger mess out of the big mess or do I take a deep breath and which I did put the kids to bed and said I'll deal with that later and when I came downstairs to clean up the pasta that was all over my kitchen floor I'm like um how can I turn this lemon into a lemonade this might turn out to be a cool art project so I cleaned up all the pasta and then I just decided that I was going to test a little bit and experiment a little bit with an art project or a frugal craft using the dried spilled spaghetti. So here's what I did. I took some on um, cardstock and I just dropped the spilled spaghetti and you can kind of see on this picture here I ended up using this as a background to as a photo frame for my kids. So I just dropped the spaghetti on the cardstock and then I decided to get some spray paint. I had a can of this in my craft drawer. You can, I'm sure, get this at Walmart or Michaels. And I just sprayed it all over the dried spaghetti. And I let it dry, and then I took off the spaghetti, and then it made this really cool pattern. Now, because the picture's already glued on here, and I don't wanna like, rip the picture off or anything, but I mean, it turned out pretty cool in the background as an idea to frame my kids' pictures. And what I thought was cool about this is that, you know, sometimes when we're mothers of young children and the messes just drive us nuts. But I thought that this was a really good reminder for me that kids make messes and that we should frame the moments when they make the messes because they're really cute when they're this little and help make messes. So I thought my spilled spaghetti would just be a good reminder with my children that it's okay that we deal with messes and we can turn it into art and we can embrace the mess. Uh, I also grabbed a frame at the dollar store and here's the, another one that I made for my other daughter and so now I've got great photo, frugal photo displays for my children which is a fun reminder that spilled spaghetti can turn into fun art. And when you have coupons like this one, 55 cents off one, this is Barilla. I bought a bunch of these on coupond.com. And right now, the boxes of pasta are $1.39, I believe, at Wegmans, depending on, I think, the shape of the pasta. But $1.39 minus $1.10 is $0.29 cents for a box of pasta. So when it gets dropped on the floor, or you decide to use this as an art project, it's not going to cost you an arm and a leg, and it's super cheap, and it's fun. So that's what I have for you today. And if you'll excuse me, I now have more dried pasta to go clean up. Ugh.